Orange County Mayor Teresa Jacobs told us she's waiting on a phone call from Amazon. She's hoping to learn why the company turned down Orlando for its second headquarters. Channel 9's Ty Russell talked to the mayor right after the yearly economic summit today about that and about local job growth. Orange County now plans to attract tech giant Apple's planned new campus along with 20,000 new jobs. When you talk about how do we get Apple here, how do we get companies like that here, the cultural environment matters enormously. You don't want to work or you don't want to live. But Amazon just turned down the county's proposal to move its second headquarters to Orlando. The mayor still doesn't know why. You know, I would have loved to have been on the top 20. I don't, I don't want to be coy about that. Mayor Jacobs and her team told me they suspect the region's lack of a large-scale transit system is to blame, unlike places in the Northeast, which are areas in Amazon's top 20. Sunrail's expansion into Osceola County may attract the big tech giants, and she says Brightline train connecting Orlando to Miami may help too. We're on the cusp of making some uh, dramatic changes on how we move people around. Leaders say having the second largest university in the nation is not enough to attract big tech companies. Tim Giuliani with Orlando Economic yeah, so Partnership it's, it's, says the area should focus more on science, technology, engineering, and math. It's also called STEM. We do need to do more. We do need more STEM education. We do need to focus that throughout the entire um, learning system so that our workforce is better prepared. Right now, it's unclear when the county will submit a proposal to Apple, but Mayor Jacobs believes thousands of high-paying tech jobs will be on the way. Our time is coming. We have, we're in a young city by all standards, and we have so much momentum ahead of us. In Orange County, Ty Russell, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.